Hello everyone and welcome to this example. We're gonna graph um, x squared minus 3 using a vertical shift. Right, so basically, um, let's see what happens when you subtract 3 from the basic x squared function. Alright, so let's graph the x squared function. So we're just gonna graph f of x equals x squared. So this is 0, 0. 1 squared is 1, 2 squared is 4, 3 squared is 8, uh, 9, negative 1 squared is 1, negative 2 squared is 4, and negative 3 squared is 9. So here's our basic x squared parabola. All right, and well, let's make a table of values and figure out values for x squared minus 3. Okay. So 0, 0 squared minus 3 is going to be 0 minus 3, which is negative 3. 1 squared minus 3, 1 minus 3 is negative 2. 2 squared minus 3, 4 minus 3 is 1. 3 squared minus 3, 9 minus 3 is 6. On the other side, same values. So negative 1 squared minus 3 is negative 2. Negative 2 squared minus 3 is 1, and negative 3 squared minus 3 is 6. Okay, so let's graph these. I have 0, negative 3, 1, negative 2, negative 1, negative 2, 2, 1, negative 2, 1, 3, 6, negative 3, 6. All right, so this is our parabola here. So this is x squared minus 3. So you can see that like all the original y values, we subtracted 3 from them, so all the points shifted down 3 units. So it got translated vertically down 3 units from the original x squared graph. Okay. 